Captain. This might be our last chance to get to the bottom of this mess. Agreed, Captain. Damage appears to be from several rifle rounds. There's blood on the clippers. Severed carotid artery. Nasty way to go. His security clearance is the same as mine. Guess the boss didn't trust him with the keys. There's a button under here. Captain Cassini, thank God it's you. Oh no, Denko. I'm sorry, ma'am. He didn't make it. Oh no, poor Denko. Take a moment to calm yourself, Mrs. Maguire. <gasps> okay. Okay. What happened here? I went to the bathroom, as you said. Then there were gunshots, and shortly after that, the power went out. When the power went on, I just stayed where I was safe. You did the right thing. Your boss. I need to see him. I doubt he's still here, but you can take my clearance. I quit. Mrs. Maguire, head to my ship. I need to look around. Thank you, Captain Cassini. By the way, the password to Mr. Volkov's computer is Perseus. What? Why are you giving me this? You're a good man, Captain Cassini. Mr. Volkov is not. I hope this helps. Call the department. Rust Police Department. Hey, Bob. How are things at the refinery? The Logans have had a run-in with some droids. There are several casualties. Hold tight, hun. I'm sending backup. Copy that. Call Tom. Cassini, do you have something to report? I'm at the refinery. It looks like some kind of battle has taken place. There might not be much time. See if you can use this distraction to gather any intel. Copy that. Good luck. Okay then. I wonder where the general got to. It is highly probable he went out by the other elevator. Yeah, but is he still on this rock? Computer, speak the password. Leonardo. Incorrect password. Raphael. Incorrect password. Perseus. Unable to authenticate voice. Biometric verification required. This is just a glorified drinks cabinet. Captain? I was expecting something more confidential. I expect the General keeps anything important in his computer. Right.
There's some minor scorching on the outside. Looks like it was hit by an electrical weapon. Computer, speak the password. Perseus. Unable to authenticate voice. Biometric verification. Do you think the General did this? He is the only person we haven't accounted for, Captain. This computer needs biometric verification. The subject's fingerprint should be adequate for me to interface with this computer. Status report. Droids and Nebula Ventura security forces have clashed resulting in several casualties. General Kuznetsov is missing. Okay then. Looks like there's a fingerprint on this. Hey Mac, can you lift the fingerprint off this glass? Affirmative, Captain. I have the fingerprint, Captain. It is not recognized in any of our databases. I didn't know you could do that. There's a lot you don't know about me, Captain. Can you access that computer now? If this fingerprint satisfies the biometric requirement, Captain. Can you find out what's on this computer? Affirmative, Captain. Find anything interesting, Mac? Map showing the search history of facilities, including the incident with Arela. What else? Directives from Locust to set up Nebula Ventura, financing details, financial transfers to CETA's official. We got them. A manifesto of all machines containing CETA's citizens. That's gold, Mac. What would you like me to do with this information, Captain? <laughs> Send it over to Bishop. Affirmative, Captain. Is there anything you would like to query, Captain? Where are the machines that have people in them? All machines are of local origin, but I do not have enough information to determine present locations. What kind of machines have people in them? They are limited to mining equipment and max. How many people are on that list? The records show 83% of 9,978 remain active. What do you mean by that? The records contain deactivation dates. They're killing them! In the human sense of the word, Captain. Why do they keep the bodies? Experimental notes indicate the consciousness disappears when the body expires. That doesn't make any sense, it's just data. The early experiments show attempts at direct data copy, but the intelligence degraded over time. This method appears to rely on some kind of quantum entanglement to preserve a sense of self. So you're saying if a machine wakes up, their body is still alive? According to this data. Is there a Juliet Cassini in those records? Yes, Captain. Juliet Cassini is listed as active. Where is she? To find out, we would need to cross-reference with the right machine IDs. I do not currently have access to any relevant databases. Wait, Mac. Are you... Is someone... in you? According to these records, Captain. Who are you? It is... not relevant, Captain. 
Knowing this information gives me no recollection of this person. Who are you? I am Jennifer Wallace. 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 I don't know any Jennifer Wallaces. Neither do I, Captain. Have you considered the possibility that not everyone wakes up? I guess not. So, would you like to be called Jennifer? No, Captain. Please do not do that. Okay, Mac. Why did they do this? It appears they are attempting to make a more intelligent machine by taking baseline human intelligence and inhibiting core memories. So they were making slaves? Why are machine slaves if they have a human consciousness instead of an artificial intelligence? Ah, uh, yeah. Interesting question. One I'm definitely not qualified to answer. I always thought of you as a guy. Thank you, Captain. Maybe we should try to wake you up. Shock you or something. I would advise waiting for a more appropriate time to try something that could potentially destroy me, Captain. That's enough. Bishop? Cassini, we got your data dumped. Where'd this come from? I got it from the General's computer. The refinery is going to hell. It's some really compelling stuff, Cassini. Some pretty big heads will roll out of this. Speaking of which, I think the General is still here. Watch yourself. The General is not someone you want to mess with. Neither am I, Cassini out. This door is ID controlled. This door is ID. Do you think the droids are still functional? Structurally, they look undamaged. It is possible only their internal circuits were affected. Why don't you want to be called Jennifer? It would be disrespectful to Jennifer's memory. It may be painful for those that knew her. Okay. Okay then. Mac, 
Do you think you could control a different body? If I can only interface with machines I am compatible with. What if I were to put you into a different machine with that device we found in the Logan ship? I do not think it works that way, Captain. I think we should give it a try. I do not want to be an experiment, Captain. That's not what I meant. I will consider it if you have a specific scenario in mind, Captain. Right. I don't think I'm doing... I don't think I'm doing that. Okay then. Jeez! Too hot. Okay then. Okay then. Okay then. Ah! Too bloody hot! Too hot. Okay then. Mac, if I put you in this droid, do you think you can lift that pipe out of the way? I'll try, Captain. Okay, let's go. Captain? Yeah, Mac? Don't leave me in there. Sure, Mac. Give me your word, you'll get me out as soon as possible. Uh, okay. You have my word, Mac. I'm ready now, Captain. Mac, are you okay in there? Oh, can't talk? Okay, but you can hear me? Okay, see to that pipe and I'll get you out of there.
Mac, how do you feel? I feel different, less connected. Okay, that's good. I don't know. Mac, how about this droid? Let me know exactly what you need, Captain. Right. Mac, can I put you in that welder droid to weld this pipe? Okay, Captain. You there, Mac? I think so, Captain. Mac, I need you to move this hauler out of the way with that lifter droid. Affirmative, Captain. You there, Mac? I think so, Captain. Hey Mac, you reckon someone could jump over this gap? At the current gravity, a fit young man would have an 81.4% chance of making it on the first try. Sounds like I've got a pretty good chance of making it. Okay, what odds would I get? 19.3%. Come on, it can't be that bad. Good idea. 
Nothing, Mac? Huh? Oh, quite mental, Captain. You okay, Mac? I... never mind, Captain. You sure? Yes, Captain. Wow, that's the last of the resin. We had some good times. Hey, Mac, check this out. Was that your intent, Captain? Uh, yeah. Too heavy. Right. Then what? Right, then what? Yep, then what? Yeah, that'll work. Hey, Mac. Captain? I need to weld these two pipes together and use them to bridge that gap. You need to put me in those machines again, Captain. Something wrong, Mac? It's just... this is making me really... uncomfortable, Captain. Oh. Okay, Mac. I wouldn't ask if it wasn't necessary. Okay. Mac, can you get this droid to move out of the way? Okay, Captain. No good, Mac? I don't want to do this anymore, Vince. What? I wasn't able to move. I felt trapped. Okay, Mac. We'll move it another way. Hey, Mac, can you hang by this door? Affirmative, Captain.
As you were, ma affirmative. Okay then. Mac, can you move this droid out of the way with the lifter? Ah, uh. I know, Mac. No, you don't, Vince. You don't know. Mac? Just put me in. Let's get this over with. Vince, I feel... strange. Okay, Mac. I think we should avoid doing that again. I don't know. Promise? Yeah, Mac. Mac? Oh. Okay, Vince. Where are we, Vince? Looks like the heart of the refinery. It looks like a sunset. No good. Mac, do you think you can hit that button over there? Where? Over the other side. There's no bridge. You can float, Mac. Oh. <laughs> you okay, Mac? Mm-hmm. Okay, Mac. Stay quiet, and I'll see if I can.
Mac? Did you see? I got the bastard. Julie? Don't look so shocked, Finn. A Federal Service Medal. Whew. Not a bad notch on the old resume. Pretty generous of Bishop to give me anything at all. What are you going to say when they give it to you? No one told me I had to say anything. You thought you would just slouch in there, grab the medal, and scuttle out? Oh, don't be weird. What do you think I should say? We shut down Nebula Ventura, even if we didn't manage to cut off the heads. So maybe tell them that crime doesn't pay unless you have good lawyers. At least I got Kuznets off. What came over you? I told you, Vin. I was pissed off. I don't regret it. Are these all of them? Four thousand and counting. The feds are doing a pretty good job of rounding them up. The hard part is when they find the consciousness without the body. You know, if they wake up at all, the body is still alive. I don't know which is worse. Not waking up or knowing your body could be hurtling towards some unknown star. We still haven't talked about what you want to do. I was wondering if you'd help me find a new partner. Oh. I, th I thought we'd continue looking for your body. I'd love to return to my body, if it's ever found, but I think it's best if we have some distance. I didn't think I was that bad. I just think it's best I move on. Besides, I don't want to make things awkward with you and Trish. Trish and I, we were good together for a while. But I think it's better for both of us if we admit it's over. <laughs> I think that's my cue to get out there. Break a leg. 